Hello guys, welcome to new tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn how we can send WhatsApp messages through Google Sheets. So here I have the text which I want to send to this number. To send the messages through Google Sheets, we need to use WhatsApp API. Here I am going to use the hyperlink function to create a link for API call. Type is equals to hyperlink. This is the URL template that we need to use send message. You can also copy the template URL, it is given in the description. This is yet incomplete URL. We need to somehow link the message and number to the URL. It's easy to do that. Between this ampersand signs, give reference to the contact number and after this ampersand, give reference to the text message. And since we are going to create a hyperlink, we also have to give anchor text. That will be sent. Hit the bracket, enter. Once you have generated the link, you can make an API call. Just click the link. Now that API call will open the WhatsApp browser application. Make sure you are logged into your WhatsApp account on your browser if you are using the web version. And now when you click send, the message will be sent. To send messages to a bunch of people, we can also create dynamic messages. Let's see how to do that. So here I made the list of clients and their contacts. And let's say I want to send them welcome message. To create the dynamic message, write is equals to under quotations. Hi. And between emphasis and sign, give reference to the name cell. Then again under quotations, write welcome to the team. Now Google Sheets is suggesting autofill, we can select that. Now to send the message to the exact same thing, write is equals to hyperlink, paste the URL, again give reference to the contact and the text message. And to do the same for all clients, just copy paste the formula by dragging it. Now if you click this hyperlink, it will again make an API call to WhatsApp. That will open the browser application and now when you click the send button, it will send the message to the respective person. That's all for today guys, this was a short tutorial on how you can create and send dynamic WhatsApp messages through Google Sheets. I hope you liked this video and thank you for watching.